In this video, I'm going to show you how to transfer photos and videos from an iPhone to a Windows PC or your Mac system without a USB cable. This is how I do it, and it retains the original quality or allows you to choose to retain the original quality of the video or the photo. So I have the iPhone 16 Pro Max here. I use the Photos app and I use iCloud. So I just go to the Photos app. I just took a three second video right there just to show you guys, like if you're taking videos and photos and stuff, they're going to save to your Photos app. So the next thing you wanna do is go to iCloud.com and log in on your Mac system or your Windows computer through you know, a browser. Just log into iCloud.com, go to your photos. Once photos comes up, click on photos. So back to the mobile device here. I want you guys to go into your settings and go to your iCloud account and go into where the photos, right in here where it says photos. And this is important because you need to sync videos and photos from your device to the iCloud. So what you wanna do is click sync now and resume syncing because this pauses a lot. And this is why they might not be syncing to your iCloud account for you to download, which I'm going to show you how to do that so you can save it directly onto your Mac system or your Windows PC. Okay, so what that will do now is you might even see it pop up. Okay, so that three second video just popped up. Okay, so all we gotta do now is select the file and then it's gonna give us these three little dots. That's like a little menu, you wanna click that. You can click download and it'll download it right to your computer, right to your Mac system, right to your Windows PC. You'll just have to go to wherever your downloads are, like in your downloads folder. Uh, if you wanna download it and change anything or keep original quality, select that and then you'll have a bunch of different options up here available for you. You know, on you would just click this over over here to download any of the you know if you're if any of that relates to you or you want to download it differently you can do that but it'll retain the original quality same thing with this photo right here just select those three little dots go to more download options and it lets you download it like most compatible however you want to do it so right here's the file on my desktop now and if i open it up i can play it that's the three second video that i did that's all you really need to do Okay, so I hope this helps you guys out. If it helped you in any way, hit the like button, subscribe if you want to. I'll see you in the next video.